Dropper malware is a type of trojan that carries malicious code to install malware on a computer. Droppers are often hidden in a computer's directories. A dropper is a kind of trojan that has been designed to install malware to a computer. The malware code can be contained within the dropper in such a way as to avoid detection by virus scanners, or the dropper may download the malware to the targeted computer once activated. There are two types of droppers. Spammers and other bad actors use droppers to circumvent the signatures that antivirus programs use to block or quarantine malicious code. It's much easier to change the dropper, should its signature become recognized, than it would be to rewrite the malicious code base. Droppers, like many of their larger Trojan horse counterparts, can be persistent or non-persistent. Non-persistent droppers install malware and then automatically remove themselves. Persistent droppers copy themselves to a hidden file and stay there until they complete the task they were created for. Droppers can be spread by people who Open an infected email attachment Pick up a drive-by download on an infected website Click on a malicious link in an email or on a website using an infected flash drive. Sometimes droppers are bundled with free utility programs, such as ad blockers, to avoid detection by antivirus software. When the free program executes, the dropper will first download and install malware before it unpacks and installs the legitimate utility. The primary purpose of a dropper is to install other malicious tools, its so-called payload, on the target device without the victim noticing. Unlike a downloader, which receives the necessary components from the attacker's server, a dropper already contains them. Upon launch, it extracts the payload and saves it to device memory. A dropper can also launch malware installers. A dropper's payload usually includes more Trojans. Some droppers contain only one malicious program, but most carry several malware tools. The items are not necessarily interconnected and may serve different purposes. They may even be developed by different hacker groups. They can also contain harmless files meant to mask the installation of malware. As a rule, droppers carry known trojans that the target device's security features would otherwise block. They impede malware detection at the downloading stage and neutralize system defenses before installing their payload. The neutralization mechanism depends on the target operating system type. For example, droppers for Windows typically deactivate user account control, which notifies users about any attempts to perform actions affecting critical system elements. Dropper types. Droppers can be persistent or non-persistent. Persistent droppers copy themselves to a hidden file and can reinstall themselves if removed. Non-persistent droppers uninstall themselves from the infected device upon payload installation.